Hi guys, what's going on? Alex here. Welcome to Foot Fantasy Day number one on FIFA. As you can see, the Foot Fantasy screen is here. And we'll head over to the store to open our first pack of Foot Fantasy as well. It's going to be the Pivot Essentials pack. Hopefully we can get a Foot Fantasy, please. It's nice, just a gold rare, but it's an 86 plus guarantee. But we'll look at SBCs. Uh, we'll look at objectives as well. Ah. And we'll see what we get. From there, the team is already out on the Twitter, guys. So, I'll have a look at objectives. We've got Guiri Foot Fantasy, 87 left mid. This guy looks okay. We'll start with Forstar Theresa. Hmm. With left mid, left wing, centre forward, striker. Some good pace, some okay shooting stats. And some nice passing stats, some good dribbling stats as well. The finish stats are okay as well, to be fair for him. And with some upgrades, we could be looking at some super good cards here. Yeah. This foot fancy item is eligible for four additional upgrades in the next six domestic league games. And that is super good. So if the player makes three appearances in the next six games, he automatically gets a plus one. And if he scores two or assists two, could be one and one. In the next six games, he gets plus one with Guiri being an attacker. Very likely. That could be two upgrades for Guiri. If the club wins, another one, that's plus three. And if they avoid defeat in the next six games, that'll be the next upgrade. I don't think that will happen. But look at this, the Ginola. We get a Ginola learn. What a card as well for doing this. Arsenal define the odds as they sit atop the Premier League. Can they hold on when seven matches in any game with six Prem players? A French connection with PSG looking to secure. This is for a play pick, maybe? Play pick special? Don't know what that is. And a... Uh, Oh, for Fancy Hero Team 1. 10 game loan pick for that one. This is an 8-1 double for Napoli. Uh, play 10 with 6 areas. Union Berlin, another one. A Fancy Team 1 pick again. And then Barcelona for an 8-1 double in there. But this is what we've all been waiting for, really. The SBCs. What cards are we getting? Oh, we just had a little sneaky preview there. We're going to get a Memphis Depay SBC. We did already have a Showdown SBC, but... Another Depay SBC, 5-star, 3-star, striker, left wing, and sent forward, Atletico Madrid, great pace, very nice shooting, very good passing, very nice dribbling, great physicals as well. And again, the additional information is exactly the same for all the fantasy foot players. He has the 5-star, 3-star, and what is he going to cost? An 84, 85, 87, so it's going to be a little bit expensive. Um, About the same as Wakehorst, which was almost... 350, 370, so this will be about 400k with the extra squad there. Well, with the fair squad. But it's an Atletico card. He does play for them. If he plays in three games, that's plus one. He'll probably score or assist in the next six. That's plus two. And if they win, that's definitely a plus one. So I think he will go up to a 92, which is a plus three overall. And with that plus three on all of the stats... That's going to be a super juiced up card. I'm very looking forward to that one as well. We've got Gabri Vega, the La, La Liga Player of the Month. Uh, I've already done a quick little shots video on him. But just to summarize, center mid cam, center, uh, center of the pack for this guy. Super good stats. Well, average stats, but it's only an 82 and an 83 squad. We've got Steven Berghaus, the new Eredivisie Player of the Month as well. That's interesting. He replaces Nick Olic, the goalkeeper. We've got good pace. Very nice shooting, very nice passing, very nice dribbling. It looks like a good card for two segments, 82 and an 83 as well. Same as Vega, uh, but he's two ratings higher. Okay, that's fair, but it's a nice card still. We also have Liga Tokyo Set. That's like some Mexican on Turkey, but it does look like it's the Japanese version, which is cool. And we also have any live icons? No. No, so that is the content for today. Let's take a quick look at the full squad. So as you can see, guys, this is the full squad. We've got Alexis Sanchez, Marcus Lorente, Isaac, Skriniar, Saliba, Ben Rama, Fernando Deli Ali, Angelino, Trimel, and Miller from the MLS. Uh, That's an interesting team. There's a few Canadian special cards out there. So if you're Canadian or MLS fan, you get a bunch of those. Trimel looks okay, nothing amazing. Angelina looks pretty good for a left back. Deli Ali. Actually, it does look well-rounded, and with some upgrades at Besiktas, they they will win uh, some games. And if he does play, I think he does get some game time. Um, then that will be some nice upgrades for Deli Ali. We've got Fernando. He's going to be a really good DM with some upgrades again. I expect all these guys are going to get some upgrades. We've got Ben Rama, Saliba, 
Skriniar looks very nice. Uh, Isaac at Newcastle. If Newcastle wins some games and he scores, he's going to be incredible. Lorente up there as well at Atletico Madrid. He'll get the same upgrades as Memphis Depay. And that would be awesome. And Alexis Sanchez at Marseille as well. They all look like they are going to be super, super good cards. And I don't think there's any extra content. But let's have a look on Footboom. We've got the heroes as well. Ginola, Crouch, Captavia, Cordoba King and Abedi Pele. They are going to be awesome. And probably bring the price down of these cards as well. Captavia, I wonder what price Crouch is at. Oh, don't care. Now, of course, we've already seen the Ginola from the Learn Objective. But this card looks immense. Striker cam, left mid, left wing. What a card. The in-games are looking crazy juiced. This is just a great card. If you want a, a Hunter, that is one of the best cards. It's going to be 5 star, 5 star as well. 6 foot 1, he is a monster. Maximum 5 mil. Probably not going to get packed ever by anyone, but good luck if you do. Next to him, we've got Peter Crouch as well. A second promo card for Crouch this year. Look at that man. He's going to be incredible in this game. Same as... Weghorst, maybe Weghorst is actually probably better than this Crouch card. Very nice pace, great shooting stats, lacking on that shot power. Has some good passing stats as well, nice dribbling, and some very good physicals as well. Does he have a price at the moment? 200k, okay, very nice. Then we've got Cap de Villa, the left back. Cap de Villa is coming in at 3 million coins, that's outrageous. But of course, all these guys can also get upgraded as they follow one of their major clubs throughout their career. And Cap de Villa is with Villarreal, and at 3 mil, that guy's going to be insane. I don't think it'll actually affect the price of these cards too much, because these cards are going to be way too expensive. Then we've got Cordoba, water card. This guy's been expensive for a long time. He's been about 350 to 250 for for a long time, really. In-games in on this guy, he's playing for Inter Milan as well, and they're going to get everything they need for upgrades on this guy. What a card that is. Super fast, great defending, great physicals, great everything really. What a centre back. Then we've got Lidley, King of Spares, I do believe. This guy's coming in max 500k at the moment. And he looks okay, some nice in games, good pace. Nice dribbling, it's okay. Really good defending and physicals as well. The super card there. And the last one is Abedi Pele. And he's coming in without card on the mark at the moment. Four star, four star. Really good pace. Shooting is not amazing, but with Marseille, he follows Marseille for this. Great passing. Really nice dribbling stats as well. Four star, four star has a chance to get some good upgrades. And finally as well, guys, these are the price of the SBC. So the pie is about that 370 mark. Super nice card. It's got good upbirds and it probably will get some upgrades. So it will be a very nice card for the Atletico player. The kit set, don't care. We've got Steven Berghaus, 40, 50k for an 88 Eredivisie card. And Gabri Vega, 40,000 uh, coins there for the La Liga Player of the Month. Uh, he's looking pretty good and tasty. So that has been the new content for Foot Fantasy. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed that. That's been good. We've opened a pack. We've looked at the team. We've looked at the heroes. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care and peace.